What is the value of the expression 8 divided by 1 over 8 times 8 divided by 1 over 8? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? Mm. This question has puzzled many people and led them to pick the wrong option. Let's take a closer look and solve it together. In the first step, many people go straight to the expression 1 over 8 times 8 because they think multiplication has priority over division and they tend to cancel out the 8s. So, this expression simplifies to 8 divided by 1 divided by 1 over 8. In the next step, they go for the division between 8 and 1 and rewrite this expression as 8 divided by 1 over 8 which gives them the answer 64. Then, without any hesitation, they claim that option B is the correct choice. But this answer is absolutely wrong. Now let me show you how to solve this expression properly. To solve this question, we need to apply the PEMDAS rule. It means that we must stick to the correct order of operations and go through it from top to bottom step by step. Alright, as you can see in the image, we have two division signs and one multiplication sign. It's very important to remember that multiplication and division are on the same level of precedence. So, in this case, we simply start from the leftmost part of the expression and continue step by step toward the right. It means that we begin with the expression 8 divided by 1 over 8, which I have marked in yellow. Okay, whenever we come across a division sign between two terms, the best thing to do is to apply the KCF rule. In this rule, K stands for keep the first number as it is, C stands for change the division sign to multiplication, and F stands for flip the second fraction. We remove the highlighted part and replace it with 8 times 8. Now we can write this expression as 64 times 8 divided by 1 over 8. In the next step, we multiply 64 by 8, which simplifies it to 512 divided by 1 over 8. And for the part which I have highlighted in blue, according to the KCF rule, we write it as 512 times 8, which results in the final answer 4096. Therefore, option D is the correct answer to this question.